her ability to relate to kids, to actually hit the curriculum, to not get overwhelmed with teaching, you know, grade seven phys ed as well as kindergarten music was, uh, was phenomenal. Normally any regular teacher would probably be overwhelmed with what we were asking of her and uh, we have fondly called her the unicorn. Well, it was overwhelming at first, but I, it's been, it's been special. It was very, very special to be nominated in the first place and now to be able to represent Grimminia and Parkland School Division at a higher level is, um, it's, it's, a, it's an honor and a privilege to be able to do that. You come in here in the mornings and our school starts very early. Uh, our buses arrive at 7.35 in the morning and by 7.40 this room that she teaches in has about, I don't know, a handful to a dozen junior high students who are chatting her up in the morning. And then in the lunch hours you see them all circling around her again. And then the little ones are always like high-fiving and finding her to make sure that they like connect with her. So I, yeah, she's awesome. Before here I worked with a lot of um, early education specialists as well worked at a daycare myself. So I learned how to um, teach PE and music to the very, very little ones and kind of just translated all those skills up into the different grades that I teach now. Music education and just teaching music has been a passion since early years in my life. And being able to translate that excitement to the kids so that they're excited too is a joy of mine. So I hope to continue it for a very long time. The winner of the Edwin Parr Award for Exceptional First Year Teaching is Miss Isabella Ramos. She was our only recipient at the Milestones and Merits. So myself and Mrs. Chester were very excited to be able to go because she was going, but also we knew the secret that she was going to be uh, awarded the other award that night. And um, it was pretty interesting just to hold on to that little snippet of information and then her response and uh, reaction of her friends uh, that were there were really good. Well, it was nice to know that my administration believed in me and what I could do. So I felt supported and I felt like I pretty much could do anything. I'm proud to be able to do this for my school division and I hope to continue just um, making us proud. Parkland School Division, where the world opens up.